Hello Eric DIY viewers! Today we are reviewing the Chestnut Roll Up Travel Storage Bags. There's four large size ones, 28 by 20 inches, and there's four medium size ones, 24 by 16 inches. And we're gonna show you how they're used and how I intend to use them. So if you've been watching our other reviews, you'll see that there's a lot more camping equipment recently. That's because Zach and I are going on our first real overnight camping trip at the beach in Massachusetts here in June. So I've been getting a bunch of products for that. So we wanted the storage bags to store our clothes in this backpacking backpack and have more space. We're gonna demonstrate this with some heavy clothes. On the right side, right over here, we have a medium space saver bag. And on the left, we have a large one. So Zach's clothes are gonna go in the medium one and mine are gonna go in the large one. Now when you think space saver bags, you're thinking, oh, I have to take a vacuum and suck all the air out. But the great thing about the chestnut roll-up travel storage bag is that you basically just roll them up with everything inside and it releases the air and then it keeps it out so it's a vacuum seal. On my side, just for comparison, there's a good, I'd say eight and a half inches of clothes on my side. And on Zach's side, he has about five and a quarter inches on his side. So let's pack this up and then we'll see how much it packs it down by. We're just gonna put all my clothes into the large roll-up travel storage bag. And the second step is you're gonna take the zippered compartment and you're gonna zipper it up. They give you these handy clips to close the bag. If you happen to lose the clip, it's okay because you just can do this by hand as well. So it's not imperative that you have the clip. You just have to make sure it's really sealed up. And the next step is that you're going to roll the bag. And what's going to happen is it's going to release the air here right on the bottom, which is going to seal up after and keep all the air out. So I'm going to roll it up like this. You can hear the air releasing itself. And you're going to roll up the clothes in the bag, nice and tight. Getting all the air out. Your goal is to get all the air out of the bag. And there you go. Remember, you got Two, style, uh, two sweater style shirts in here and a pair of jeans. As you can see, it's a lot more compressed. Let's take a measurement. Spray it out more in the bag. You'll be able to roll it a lot better and get more air out. But this is looking pretty good. We are now down to about four and a half inches. So Zach's got two sweater like shirts and a pair of pants. What's the first step, bud? What do we gotta do? Open it. And open it up. You wanna open it up? Yep. Okay. Bag up and why not put the clothes in for me, okay? One thing at a time. Zach, what's the second thing we gotta do? Zip it up. You wanna try? Yep. Push down while you move across, but last step is that we're gonna take the bag, we're gonna roll it up. Push it really, really light, heavy, okay? Then pull the ear out of the bag, and you can see that it's more compressed. If you have thinner layers, you could spread it up more in the bag. Zach has compressed his clothes down to three. Maybe half inches. What makes these great for camping especially is one, it's gonna save you more space in your backpack. It won't save you weight, but it'll save you space. Two, you can just reuse them. So when you're at the campsite, you put your clothes in there, you could have one for dirty clothes, one for clean clothes, and just roll them up in this bag. And if you're backpacking, obviously you can just do one bag to carry all the clothes you need and try to compress it down as much as you need. The chestnut roll-up travel storage bags are an excellent thing to have for storage at home or when you're going camping. They seal up very, very well and they're really easy to use. And when you buy them, you actually buy them in a package of eight. If you'd like to purchase your The Chestnut roll-up travel storage bags, please look for a link in the description below. We'll send you to Amazon where you can purchase your very own. You'll be supporting the Eric DIY channel at the same time. We appreciate all your support. And if you'd like to see more reviews like this, please give us a thumbs up and push that subscribe button and have a great evening. As always, if you like this video, found it useful, please subscribe. And if you have a product that you would like reviewed, please contact Eric by emailing him at Eric. 5150 DIY at gmail.com. Have a great day.